hey guys welcome back to my channel sunny beauty here and i'm back with another video so guys today i'm going to be doing my self-care routine here i'm just setting the mood lighting my candles i'm just going to get ready for my self-care day because i really look forward to these days it's kind of like a you know like a big reset for me so i really try to you know set the mood and get my intentions right and get my mind on my self-care So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to be dry brushing. Um, I actually use a dry brush every other day or probably two, three times a week. Now I just do it on my self care days, but dry brushing is amazing because it exfoliates the skin, gets rid of dead skin cells, and it also helps with your lymphoid drainage. If you use the opposite side, it also can help with like cellulite reduction and such. So I would highly suggest getting into dry brushing. I wasn't always into it, but I love it. Now I'm going into my shower routine. Of course, I'm using my Dr. Bronner's Tea Tree Soap. Love my Dr. Bronner's and I'm using my exfoliating towel. Um, it's more like a rag, but it's really long, so it's called a towel. I love this rag so much, I use it daily. I love it because it's long, I can reach my back, and it really does help to get my body really clean and remove any dead skin cells. Next, I'm going in with my Dove Sensitive Skin Body Wash. This I'm using for my intimate areas. I know that a lot of girls like to use the bar soap. I love the body wash. And I'm going in with a white rag. If you know, you know, from my last video, I said I love to use white rags for those areas because I need to see that I'm really clean, okay? <laughs> to shave, I'm going in with the EOS Shave Butter 24-Hour Moisture Shave Cream. I love the formula of this. It smells so, so, so good. And it also is really nice and silky once I shave. And I'm using my Flamingo Shaver. I love this razor because I get a really close shave. And I love the fact that I can buy replacement heads for them. So I have this for a long time. I change out the heads pretty frequently, to be honest. I noticed lately my feet have been a little bit more on the dry side. I get pedicures and such and I moisturize my feet regular, but I don't know if it's because of the summer and wearing sandals and I've been living in my Crocs actually. I find that my feet have been getting a little drier. I went ahead and bought this pumice bar from Amazon and it's a game changer. Like I don't know why I didn't have this before, but I love it. So I'm just wetting my face right now with some water because I'm going into my skincare routine. I'm using my Foreo and the CeraVe Salicylic Acid Cleanser. You guys know I love this combination. I take my time when washing my face. I'll cleanse it for like two minutes and then rinse. Next, I'm going to be using my steamer. Now, I only use my steamer on self-care days. I don't use it all the time. I just use it maybe like twice a month. And I just leave this to steam for like about 10, 15 minutes, sometimes 20 minutes. And then I go in and do extractions. I didn't show you guys any extractions because I thought it might be like gross for you guys. I don't know. This is the Innisfree Pore Clearing Clay Mask. Now guys, this mask is so affordable. I love Innisfree as a brand. They sell such affordable products and they are amazing. So I'm just applying this to my face and I'm just gonna let it sit and dry for a little bit. 
And then game changer, guys, I'm going in with this reusable cleansing pad. Um, this can actually remove makeup. I haven't used it for makeup, but I do like it for when I have a face mask or something and I don't wanna, you know, disturb my lashes. So this is really a game changer for people who have um, lash extensions and you don't wanna get the lashes super wet, you know? So I really like it. So I'm just gonna go in and remove the mask with that. In between each wipe, I do rinse, and then I'm gonna do like a final rinse right now. And my face is super clean. It feels so fresh and tingly. And then to tone, I'm using the Pixi Glow Tonic. Pretty new to using this toner because as you know, I always use the Ordinary uh, Glycolic Toner, but there was a sale on this one, so I decided to pick it up, and I'm really liking it so far. For my lips, I'm going in with the Summer Fridays Lip Balm. This is a game changer. Way better than the Laneige Sleep Mask. I promise you, go get you some. For serum, I'm using the Good Molecule Discoloration Toner. I really like this. I'm seeing a very big difference in my skin. Um, it really does target hyperpigmentation and any like dark pigment, um, so any scarring and such. And then of course to moisturize, I'm using my CeraVe SA Renewing Lotion. Love this lotion. From the moment I used it, I fell in love with it. Brushing through my lashes, of course, because I want them to get fluffy again since they got a little wet. And then I'm gonna go in and do a little bit of tweezing. I don't tweeze often because honestly, my, my brows, I barely get them done. Um, but I'm gonna tweeze a teeny, teeny bit just so you know they're a little bit fresh. And I only like to do the underneath and that's it. I'm going in with 10 Skin. This is a razor bump solution. And because I did shave my armpits, I don't want any razor bumps. And I also got a Brazilian wax about a day or two before this. So I'm using it on my bikini line as well. My favorite deodorant, of course, the native coconut and vanilla. And then to moisturize my body, I'm going in with the CeraVe Moisturizing Cream. Guys, this moisturizing cream is amazing. You have to have it. I'm also mixing in my Johnson's Shea and Cocoa Butter Oil Gel. This combo, game changer. Like that oil gel with any lotion, game changer, but especially with the CeraVe Body Moisturizing Cream. You're, you're gonna be moisturized for a full 24 hours, I promise you. And you'll have a nice glow as well, especially for the summer. Because I'm pregnant, I'm using Bio Oil and the Palmer's Stretch Mark Lotion. I've been using these two ever since I found out I was pregnant, around like eight weeks pregnant. And I don't have any stretch marks or anything. I don't know if it's because of this, but I've been using it and it's been working, I guess. Next, I'm going in with my Gua Sha. I think that's how you pronounce it, Gua Sha. Gosha. I'm not sure, but I think it's pronounced Gua Sha, but I use this mostly at night, but I did want to add it into my self-care routine uh, for you guys, just so you guys can see. I'm just going to be doing a little bit of massaging on my face and lymph node drainage, you know, the whole works today. I usually use rose hip oil when I do this, but my face is pretty hydrated and slick right now, so it was fine. And then to finish off, of course, I'm using my favorite, Zara Femme. It's such a nice like vanilla musky scent for like every day and in the house. But yeah, guys, that brings us to the end of my self-care routine. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one.